In today's tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to trim a nail for someone who is at risk of getting an ingrown toenail and how to restore these nails back to a beautiful condition. So stay tuned. Today, I'm going to take off a little bit of that length, so right now where it's sitting in the nail groove, mm -hmm. right now your nail is past. So if this is your skin and this is your, my pinky is the end of your nail, right now your toenail is hanging past that skin and it's okay, you don't, you're not having any pain. So today, I'll cut back the skin just to about here, so in four weeks, that skin isn't going to close up so and then when it grows up and you need to trim it you won't have any pain so you only have a window of opportunity of a, of a little bit you don't want to cut it back too far because then that skin just folds right up into that nail groove and then when it grows back it just hurts like heck this is the callus remover it dissolves the dead skin on the bottom of the feet so I can file it off, it comes off really easy. If this is your first time visiting my channel, welcome. This is Cuticle Remover. It dissolves all the dead skin that is around the nail and on the nail plate so I can remove it easily. And I'm using acrylic nippers to cut the toenails because when you use fingernail clippers, it bends and splits the toenails. When you're using cuticle nippers to trim the nails, you need to be careful to hold the blades parallel to the nail plate and not tip the pointed end into the, into the toe or tip the nippers forward or backward. You need to hold them parallel to the nail plate. Relax your toes there. When I start to trim the big toenail, I'm going to go really slow and be very careful because when somebody has an ingrown toenail or the beginning of an ingrown toenail, it is sore and the toenails tend to be really dry and brittle and if you clip it too low, it will just shatter all the way across the nail plate and cut it way too low. So I'm just going to take off a little bit at a time until I get to the desired length. She's really soft spoken so you can't hear what she's asking but she's asking if you have to cut and file the nail straight across. People who are prone to ingrown toenails like you, yes but not necessarily for anybody else. Anybody else, it's safe to see this line. It looks like a little smiley face where your toenail attaches. Mm -hmm. Everybody else can shape their nail in that shape. But when you have this skin that wants to fold up mm -hmm. on you, if you were to round this, then all of that skin goes up in there and then your nail has to cut through that again.
I get ahead of myself a little bit and I pick up my cuticle pusher and start to push back the skin. Now it does dissolve the skin, that's its job, but it also will start to evaporate and get hard again. So it's easier to remove the dead skin the when it is remover, still it soggy. Purpose as the callus remover, it just dissolves all of this dead skin, makes it turn white, and then I can see what's dead and what's alive, and I can remove all of that. So could you tell how when I added the cuticle remover on top of that skin that I had already started to push back, how it just kind of sloughed right off? And that's why you always add another and drop. After I do this, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna smooth out. See all these little um, lines in your toenails? They are retaining that mica from the dirt. So I'm just gonna smooth out that top layer of your nail so that doesn't happen for a while. If you're planning on purchasing any of the tools on my online store that I'm using. The pedicure kit has both the angled cuticle pusher and it comes with a free sidewall cleaner. The toenail package does not include the angled cuticle pusher. You have to add that mm -hmm. separately. But the pedicure package has the cuticle remover, the angled pusher, the stainless file, the nippers, and then the free ingrown sidewall cleaner, which I'm using right now. It's good that you clean it when you get out of the shower so a lot of dead skin doesn't get built up underneath there. You're doing a good job. So this is just a cross cut um, bit. If it touches your skin it won't hurt you but I most likely will not touch your skin. Fingernails and toenails are porous and when combined with some superficial ridges it is really easy to retain some staining from dirt. So I'm just lightly going over the surface of the nail plate yeah, to buff pretty. off that top surface and a slight ridging just to get off all of that staining that's the nail plates retaining. gonna rain all day today do you know Yeah, the angle with your hands, yeah. And sometimes when the nail is dry and if you cut it, it shatters and it goes down low anyway. Again, she's so soft-spoken, you cannot hear the questions that she's asking, but she's asking me about the angel foot file.
Mm -hmm. All the inventory is in the basement. Yeah. That's where we go downstairs and fill all the orders from online. And they'll last anybody at home their whole life. <laughs> I've done over 500 pedicures with just this one file. Ooh. Yeah, and it's as sharp as the day I got it. <laughs> right? I won't let you fall. I'll hold on to you. <laughs> it amazes me when someone close enough to come in sees one of my videos. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. We have beautiful toes. Beautiful nail plates. Talking about. Right. Just slap some polish on you. Yeah. Right. Then you'll put on polish. <clears throat> Sometimes it just feels good to have naked toes. Right. My mother-in-law is like that. Right. So you have good feeling in your toes, just not on the bottom? Yeah. You know, I don't, everybody has different feet. I mean, all different shapes and sizes and needs, and I just like it all. I don't think it's really funky. I think it's like, I'm like a detective. I like to figure it out and then solve the problem, make them look better. It's instant gratification for me and for them. Yeah. Yep. Oh yeah. Yeah. <coughs> so that new that there's a nail salon down there yeah. now. Yeah, it just opened. Yeah. Yeah, that's a walk-in place. You can't make appointments and stuff. There. They what? 
Don't forget to leave me a comment for your chance to win one of the tools I'm using in the video. You can just say hello or tell me what you learned or even what your favorite part of the video was. Everyone that leaves a comment will be entered into a drawing and the winner will be posted on the community tab of my channel. So be sure you're subscribed so you'll get the notification of the winner post. One comment will also be chosen for the comment hall of fame on my Instagram. And do give me a thumbs up so more people have a chance to see the video. How long ago did you move back from Vegas? Okay. Why did you guys pick that area to move to? He had what? He has a car. Oh, okay. He didn't think you'd really do it. <laughs> right. Do you have children that live here? <laughs> it's very relaxing. Hi. Yeah. The atmosphere just sucks all the moisture out of your skin there. <laughs> right. <laughs> well, we just became the master distributor in the United States for a foot care line out of the Netherlands. That is the best selling foot care line in the Netherlands. Ben Fisher Cream is the cure all for dry, cracked heels. Yeah.
-hmm. Through quilting, yes. Yes. Yeah. I just drilled a hole in this and popped it in and then it came with that clamp. Yeah. As I'm getting older, I need more light. Hmm? <laughs> I tell people that when they're finished, they feel pillowy because from the massage, it relaxes the skin and it gets the circulation going so there's more blood flow and then there's more space in between the skin and the fascia and the muscles and they just feel pillowy when you walk it's it's like a cloud <laughs> you have feet like me nice high arches it's a very feminine foot <laughs> yes in the toes yes yes because you can't get your foot in it. Yeah, me too. Yep, I have the same problem. I just bought some cowboy boots and I was like, well, nope, can't get these on. They're like, really? I'm like, no, really, I cannot get them on my foot. Yeah. Yeah, and then they your foot slides around inside, yeah. This is a nice moisturizing agent too. Yeah, you can get them a gift certificate. She decided she didn't want to have any polish today, so I just have some before and after pictures coming up for you guys in just a second. Thank you so much for taking time out of your day to watch my channel. You can visit my social media sites to follow and interact, and I would really appreciate it so much if you would click that share button and share your favorite videos to help me grow my channel. Here are some other great video suggestions for you. Thanks for watching, and I will see you soon.